Welcome once again back to the Grames. You know what the deal is. You know what we're doing here. We're resuming a saved game. In the... Is, is that the one? That should be the one, I think. Yeah. Carnby is on the loose. He is a freed Carnby. He's got a sword. Can he open a door? Okay. Carnby can open these doors. Grace could not. All right, let's get it on. That's right. Oh, and he had a Tommy gun. He had a Tom. He had a Tommy gun, but he was attacking me with a sword. Well, I mean, he is a pirate, I guess. Okay, can Carnby look at this? Yeah, nothing's happening there. Carnby can't look at that. Grace could. I was never really sure what that thing was, what that map was showing us. Anything over here? Okay. Okay, Grace, I don't know where Grace went. But Carnby, it's now time for Carnby to kick ass. And he cannot chew bubble gum. gum. I assume that they did not have bubble gum back then. I mean, I don't know that for sure. So this guy's real, this guy's get up. Oh, actually, I didn't mean to go up. I'm going up. This guy's laying into me. All right, Carnby's feeling awful. Time for a cure to for what ails him, which is liquor. <sighs> That's better. Is that, is that an actual cannon? Probably. Well, I guess another, okay, no, we got him. Oh, we fell. I found a poker. Two on one. Carnby couldn't get the job done there. Well, Carnby is not invincible, as we know. Carnby is indeed quite invincible. He's gonna have to use strategy, he's gonna have to use tactics. Unfortunately, he does not have his trusty battle door with him. Maybe his fists would be faster. Like, his left hand does go pretty fast. That guy's getting me through the wall. Just, it's a matter of who can stun lock who first, I guess. I'll just drink this here. How many bullets does the Thompson have? Ten. It's not that many. But, I mean, we make do with what we have. All right, that did not like. I I shot two bullets and none of. Apparently, he was not hit.
Nope, that's, that's not working. Let's not bother with close range shooting. It's just, it's just, it's, no, it's not. It's just not something that's happening. Sh a short fuse? And a pistol. This door's locked. What about this one? Oh, that's open. Okay, so we're in this one. What is that sound we hear when we come in? I'm appreciate this guy waiting. Poker and pliers. Nope, oh, not that. Okay, that'll come in useful somewhere else. That was that was the old that was the guy with the peg leg. Like we fought him like back in the hedge maze, I think. Uh Carnby's gotta get real liquored up for this. Right, can I get that over there? And move the barrel around. There's like a bottle over there. Yeah, it doesn't like move out of position. What about this? Is there a thing there? It doesn't seem like it. Pistols already low. Okay, it only hold one at a time. Yeah, that makes sense. Code of mail. Am I wearing it? Is it like the bulletproof vest from earlier? Maybe so. all of our old friends from earlier in the game. They're all back here at the Galleon. This is where they get resurrected. I mean, when I kill them, if I kill them on the Galleon, however, do they reappear back here? Or does it take them a while to come back? 
I guess it doesn't seem like there's anything here. Aside from killing that one guy and taking his stuff. Very sneaky now. that sound wake them up? Oh, my armor's no good anymore. I guess Carnby was not able to win the one-on-three fight. just back in here or is this another one is that a different bunk I think it is because this is the one that I went into before oh, we can't go up that one okay, that's where that goes up I think you can go around... No, that's not a corner that you can go around. Let's see. I have a short fuse. There was a room that had a cannon in it. Which room was that? Like, I fell from that room into the one with the fireplace. Yeah, it was this one. Right, you can fall. We fell down in there. Nothing else in here aside from the sleeping pirate and the cannon. Short fuse. Hmm. No, doesn't seem like I'm using it. Push this. Maybe not. Well, it looks like it's connected to something. Can I cut that with pliers? Right, hold on. Sir, please. Back 
to this. Can we use the pliers? The cannon's for me! Says Carnby. Alright, can I push this? No. He's not pushing. Just to be sure, he does have push activated. He does. But pushing is not doing anything here. So we did cut that loose. He's still not using the short fuse. I mean, the fact that we cut it does imply that we would want to move it around. Can we use the poker to, I don't know, leverage it or something? It will come in useful elsewhere. Hmm. I guess I don't know what we need the cannon for. Well, what is the purpose of using the cannon? And there's a hole here that goes down to that oven. Do we want to push the cannon down there? I don't know how we would do it. Says that one's locked. This goes into the bunks. I guess it qu and like when the, when we there's like an alarm that we hear every so often. When that goes off, they'll wake up. Is there anything we need from I mean, uh, there? Must be something we need from this room or one of the dudes that are sleeping in the room. Let's see. Well, if I could get some distance between them and me, maybe I could take some of them down with the Tommy gun. Okay, let's see if we can do that. Aiming in this game is bad. Yes, yeah, so that's not not even worth trying. He took quite a few hits. That's one of them down anyway. not seem like we can actually hurt them while they're asleep. Alright, this guy's getting up. If they're waking up one at a time, that's fine. Oh, well, that's no good.
pardon me, sir, but I believe we have unfinished business. Well, we did have unfinished business, and he, he finished it. I wonder if there is a more puzzle-related solution to these dudes, rather than just fighting them all. You know, that's a thing that they've done in this game, where... There have been parts where I've been fighting dudes, but there were like other there were other solutions to actually doing it. There were other solutions. But they do let you fight them. Fighting does seem to be something that is you can you can use to get through just about anything in this game. So the two the two pirates I killed from here were not carrying anything. rubbing myself up against the bunks just to make sure just to make sure okay he's getting up seems to be everyone from this room. It doesn't seem to have actually solved any problems. But I mean, everyone's dead. And in a way, isn't that the best solution to any pro problem? Right, that's blocked. Can't get up there. That's blocked. Can't get up there. This one's, this one's, uh, locked. There's this cannon that I don't know what to do with. I can't seem to push it. I can't use the short fuse. We can drop... Oh, can I drop onto that? I don't know what that would do, but I guess it's an idea. Let's try, try dropping here. Nope. I don't know if I can drop onto the bellows. But, I mean, those bellows are so big. The fact that you're just falling down right next to them makes it feel like you should be able to fall on them. Try here. No, that's on the other side of this. Can I move fr out of here? I might be stuck on it. It seems like I cannot actually move from here. I fall here. 
That seems like that's almost onto the bellows. And again, I don't even know if I would do anything. But I feel like it's tempting to try to fall on that. Because why would why else why is there a hole in the floor in this room? What's what purpose does that serve? Let's try right here. Nope, that was the same place. Landed the same place. We'll try it one more time. No, I feel, I feel like it's not gonna do, I feel like we're not changing, we're, we're always landing in that one spot. So I don't feel like it's gonna work. I mean, even if it did, what would it do? If we fell on this and gave a big strong blow to the fire, I don't know what would happen. Anything else in this room? It does seem strange that that's there. Why is it there? Can't interact with the wood. I can't throw any more wood in that fire. Does it have anything to do with the cannon? Because, I, like I said, I untied the... Like, clipped the cannon. The cannon is now free. Can we do anything with the cannon? Is there... Oh. It's quite useful. I'm glad that it's described... I'm glad it's letting me know that it is very... It's quite useful. Thank you for letting me know that. I guess we could try opening a door with the quite useful key. this? Have we seen this guy before? On guard! Oh, is he blocking? Is this an actual swordsman? I mean, maybe if I reread the books, maybe I would find uh, who this person is. So I shouldn't do that, in other words. They made sure to put the best swordsman in the room with all the pow the black powder. So we could- we would not be able to use guns. Is, I'm guessing, what this is. Well, I'm- I'm glad I tried that. Alright. It's Edward Carnby versus, um... Maybe you might describe this fellow as a dandy? As a fop, perhaps? He's got his powdered wig. 
He's got his dainty sword. His sword is absolutely daintier than mine. Pretty tough. This this uh, this dandy has Carnby's respect. I got a keg of powder and an opuscule. I will read the opuscule. Oh, now okay. I can't just leave that alone. I have to look up that word. What is that? Hold on, hold on. Let's go to Google.com. Let's look up O P U S C U L E. O P U S C U L E. Taking a second to load. Come on, Google. I need to know what this word means. It's taking its time. All right, well, we'll read the book. Hopefully I'll get a definition by the time it's done. A powder plot. Relating the mutiny which was declared in 1769 on board HMS Dark Horse. Okay, Google says it's a small or minor literary or musical work. Apparently the, the idea that it's small or minor is an important part of the definition. Danny Boy, being small of size was able to pass alongside the salting tub. Clutching a poker, he slipped into the powder room where Captain Jenkins, his officers, and what crewmen remained loyal to king and country were all gathered. Jenkins was rallying his men with a spirited rendition of Rule Britannia. Danny stuck the fuse in the keg of powder during the first verse. He let out the string. All right. Well, we do have a poker, and we do have a short fuse. No sooner had he lit the end of the fuse with a piece of incandescent metal when the ship was buffeted by a large wave. A poorly stowed barrel slid from its mooring and blocked the way out. The fuse burned on. The men still sang, except for the troublemaker, who stood petrified in terror. Never, never, never shall be slaves still echoed in the air when the dark horse blew up. Several of the survivors claimed that Danny Boy had tried to extinguish the fuse by spitting on it. If only provisions of sand had been made ready for such emergencies. <laughs> From that time on, the stower's name was cursed by all freebooters. And so ended in flame and death the tragic tale of a fine freemaster, now resting 80 feet under the waves of the balmy Indian Ocean. All right. Are they saying we should blow up the ship? I mean, I did that, except it was a game over. We obviously have to get Grace off the ship and uh, find a way of blowing it up without us being on it. do anything with that I mean uh, pliers are not really a tool for that we could no it doesn't look like it interesting that he holds the pliers like a weapon but he's not using them keg of powder we have the poker we have the short fuse can I combine the fuse with the with the keg doesn't seem like it but I, I have the option to drop the powder, not use the powder. I 
anything else in here? Maybe not. All right. What else can I use my key for? You can open this door over here. No, not that. Save the game. Oh, did I already use... Okay, so it was a one-use key, maybe. I don't seem to have my very useful key. Yeah, that door is locked. Powder plot, keg of powder, ammunition plot. Yeah, one-use key. Can I load the cannon with the black powder? I mean, like I said, this doesn't say use. It says drop put. There's no room. If I put it down, can I put the fuse on it? it doesn't, no, it doesn't seem like it. No. Doesn't seem like it works that way. Once again, I did use the pliers on the cannon, but I don't actually know what to do with the cannon. Fight the cannon? Uh, I'm gonna kick this cannon. course, there's our favorite hole in the floor. I mean, I don't think I I don't think I'd want to put the 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 barrel in in here. I probably wouldn't in the fire. There's a guy in here. We fought him before, but then I died, but I haven't fought him this time, so let's just do that. Oh, right, he has a gun. Forgot about that. And I probably should love that. Well, he was a jolly sort. There we go. Glub, glub, glub. This room as well. Here to both be too close to do anything.
Well, we could always try to go for a gun, which, you know, tends not to work. But we could also always try it. I don't know if any of that hit. Or we could just try not using any weapons and go hand to hand. Try Carmby, give him the one, two. Okay, the one, two was not good enough. We also have a pirate pistol, which only has one shot. I don't know, maybe it's just like a really good shot, though. Powerful that shot was. But it was good enough. <sighs> now let's see. Can we push this the other way? Like, it's a pushable thing. No, not that. It doesn't seem to be- it doesn't seem to want to be pushed to the left. It doesn't seem like you can. I was wondering if this green bottle in the corner is something. Maybe it's not. Maybe it isn't. Like you can push... Yeah, I don't know. Maybe not. There's also a crack in the wall. I don't know if that's uh, anything. That's everyone that we can kill for right now, I think. I don't know if there's anything to be done in this room. Like, there's a bottle down there. It also looks like there might be another chainmail shirt up there. But... It doesn't seem like I can get it. I can move that over there, but I can't move it to the left. guy's alive again. So does he just appear? Does he respawn? Or what's the deal with that guy? What does he reappear? Can't get up here. Door, that's blocked by bars. This door is locked, and we do not have... We 
do not have a key f for a door. That door is locked. There's this dormitory room that had some dudes in it. The dudes are dead. There was nothing in the room. No items or anything. We checked around. We looked around all these bunks. seem like there's anything in here. one either. There, nope, that's back there. There's cannon room. And in the cannon room, we can fall down there. Let's see, pistol, ammunition, code of mail. We have book about the powder plot where we find out about someone blowing up the ship. Um, and we blew up the ship ourselves in when we fought that one guy so we, we, were, we were able to do that we just don't want to we don't want to we got his keg of powder but where might we use a keg of powder ammunition pliers we use pliers to cut the line that's holding the cannon but we still have the pliers so maybe there's something else we need to do with the pliers maybe they're not plied out yet we have the poker. The poker was used to light the fuse for the gunpowder thing. Uh, so the end of the poker, I guess, is hot. You can see that it's red there. So if we need to light the fuse, I guess we can do it with the poker. But where do we put a fuse? Where do we need the powder? Pistol, short fuse, Thompson, pirate sword. So puzzle items seem to be fuse, poker, pliers maybe have something yet to do, keg of powder. If, like, if we want to use the powder, the poker, the fuse, it seems like those go together. Coming useful elsewhere. I don't suppose I can use it on the cannon. Coming useful elsewhere. I know that the short fuse doesn't work if I try it on that. The keg of powder... Um, doesn't have a use. Whatever we do with it, we're going to put it on the floor. And then we maybe we just have to find the right place to put it on the floor. Where would be a good place to put this powder down and blow something up? I mean, I assume just it wouldn't blow up the whole ship. Maybe just a room. Is there a room we want to blow up? Maybe. Um, I also, again, something I'm a bit puzzled about is this cannon. Is that I undid the line... Do I have to do it on both sides? No, it seems like... doesn't seem like he's doing anything. Just wondering, was there more than one line holding the cannon here? Maybe not. Doesn't seem like he's doing anything. So if I push it, it's weird. You'd think that... He actually doesn't do his pushing animation. What does that mean? I'm, let me see something here. Push. Okay, that's his pushing animation. He doesn't do it when he's next to the cannon. So, this is weird in that I'm not pressing any... Like, I can't turn left or right now. And now I can't do the pushing animation. What does that mean? I don't know. What, what would that mean? The pushing animation gets cancelled when I get close to the cannon? Why would that be the case?
Like, that's just a strange thing. Why would that happen? I don't understand what that would mean. As I was saying, there's the hole that goes down to the room below it, in which we can fall, but why do we do that? Why is that necessary to be done? So something I did notice is that here there's like a circle on the floor. And there have been a couple rooms where like there was like a... Like a shape of an item we needed to use. I, do we put the cake of powder here? I mean, he's not putting it exactly on that. I use the, the fuse. No. Let me just try to see if I can put it exactly on that circle on the floor. He's not putting it exactly on it, so maybe it's not the uh, maybe that's not the way. Coming useful elsewhere. It just doesn't do anything there. I don't think I have any other items that would resemble, like, a circle. So there's that. Don't know what to do with that. We can't go up the ladders. Actually, hold on. There wasn't another door there, was there? Oh, there is a door there. It's locked, so it doesn't matter. But I didn't actually even see that there was a door right there. But it, there is one. Uh, but I don't have anything that can... I don't have any keys. This is the powder room. I r rubbed myself all around it. Didn't seem like there was anything. I mean, if there is a room that I want to use the powder and, like, put a fuse in it to blow it up, it seems like this is the room that I should be doing that in. But we have things to do before we can make that happen. Alright, there's that. There's this, which is, this one's a little strange to me because there is a barrel that we can kind of push around a bit, but it only kind of pushes in one direction. Unless we can fight it. Like, punch it to one side. Like, why would there be a pushable barrel unless there is a reason to push it somewhere? But even when it was in its original position, it only really pushed to the right. It didn't, it didn't want to go left. I 
I'm rubbing myself on it so slowly. It's not actually... It's not actually moving at all. But we know that it is possible to push it. But we're... Oh, okay. Well, I got that anyway. I was able to reach far enough to get that. Code of mail is not essential, though. It's just nice to have. I don't know if that bottle... The bottle stands out. I don't know if that's something that we have to get. But I mean, I was able to get that colt, that, uh, that mail from a distance. Like, I'm basically touching the bottle right now and nothing's happening. And there's this crack in the wall. Is there anything we want to do with this crack? Can we see what the other side of that is? Is it possible to see that? Like that, if that's that, that room's there. And there's this room. Uh, no, this doesn't go up far enough. This little thing here where Grace could hide. And I put, like, I don't know, the powder here. Well, no, of course I can drop the powder there. I mean, can I use anything? Like a short fuse. Doesn't seem like it. Or a poker. That'll come in useful elsewhere. All right. A barrel that can be pushed. Possibly a bottle to get... Possibly? It's hard to say. Like, a game doesn't seem to want me to do it. But why would a pushable barrel be here to begin with, if not? So that's a possible mystery. And the other, po and the other mystery so far is uh, the cannon. So those two rooms seem to be the mysteries right now. There are also two locked doors. But I don't have a key to open them. There's also this dorm room over here that had a bunch of dudes. I killed the dudes, but... I don't know, none of the dudes were carrying anything? It doesn't seem like there are items anywhere. Or really anything that Carnby is noticing. Sometimes the camera doesn't even change to where you are. So I guess that, you know, that means it's extra unimportant. locked sure is there's cannon so when i use the pliers on the cannon carnby said something like cannon is mine and he was very happy about that he was he was psyched and then this strange thing is happening where if I use push, he will not do his push animation if we are close by to the cannon. 
And he's still not doing it. So if I'm in the room with the cannon, he will not do the push animation. If I'm out in the hallway, he will do it. But when I walk into the room, he will not do it anymore. And if I press left and right, he is not changing direction. He's just walking forward in the push animation. So there's something about this cannon room that is messing with the push animation. I don't know what that is. Why will he not push? It feels like he should be moving the cannon since we undid the thing. Oh, wait, wait, hold on. Okay, I had to stand in a very specific spot. It was a very specific spot. It was not a normal push. It was a, it was a scripted push. All right. Should I use the fuse on this? I'm not standing right. Yeah, it's been a problem. Carnby. It's been a problem for a lot of this game. Okay, I think he used it now. Can I use my poker to light it? Yeah. Alright, we shot the dorm, I think. No, there's no one in it now. Okay, we can- oh, we can just blow the whole thing up without actually fighting anyone. Gold coins. So, okay, you, do, you don't actually have to fight any of the dudes in here. You can just, uh... You can just use- you can just take them out with the cannon. We got gold coins. Have we seen anything so far that gold coins would be useful for? Is any- who would want gold coins? That we have seen. I mean, we've killed everyone that we've seen so far. Like, everyone... That's been on this ship that we've seen, we- is dead. I don't suppose we melt down the gold coins. No? What was that he did? He like... We can drop him. I suppose you want gold? I know you like seeds. I don't know how you feel about gold coins. Oh no, it says drop put, so we're not talking... We're not talking about giving, we're talking about like putting them down. Oh actually, but the parrot has like a leash on him. Doesn't seem like Carnby's doing anything. Uh, does not seem like Carnby is using the pliers.
Is there anything we can do with the parrot? The parrot seems to want to fly off of its perch. But I don't think- it doesn't seem like I can use the pliers to cut the leash. Now, there was something that we did with Grace, where you can give him seeds and then he gives you clues. We did that. But we don't have seeds anymore. Also this, which my car B is not actually saying anything. It's not saying it's locked or anything. Okay, at least we figured out what the what the cannon does. And by using the cannon we can get gold coins. But I still can't get this. If I can't well, I mean I don't know if I can get it. All I know is that the barrel is pushable. But it doesn't seem like there was a reason to push it to the right. It didn't seem like there was anything in this room. Two locked doors, as well. Still can't open them. The destroyed dormitory. We got gold coins and some liquor. I didn't notice anything else in there. The cannon room maybe is solved. Like, maybe there's nothing else. Unless dropping down through there is necessary for another puzzle. But at least we solved what we were supposed to do with the cannon. I don't suppose I use an item for undoing the bars. I mean, probably not. That seems unlikely. Ah! So, okay. Room with barrel and bottle might be a thing? It's hard to say. Cannon has been used. Dormitory is solved. Parrot is still here. Does Parrot want anything? Does Parrot want gold coins? Parrot just sits there, and then occasionally tries to fly up. And sometimes says caca. As Carnby looks around in a constant state of alertness. Okay, remaining puzzle items. Pliers. Poker. Hmm. 
we have the gold as well. Poker is still there. Like, uh, that did not go away after using the cannon. Pliers are still here. So both pliers and poker are here. It'll come in useful elsewhere, apparently. I assume that we use the powder when we use the cannon. We would have had to load the pa the, the cannon with powder, I guess. I don't I don't remember. So gold coins, pliers, poker, the possibility of maybe being able to get that bottle in the barrel room. Nothing's coming to mind. Can't go up to the top deck. Both ways are blocked. Two locked doors we have not been able to get into. We do not have keys. I assume I cannot just use a puzzle item or, like, use a weapon to bash it open. That's could I mean, who knows? It could always be possible. I can't put it down. There's not enough room. All right. All right, that's down there. Code of mail, pliers, code of mail, pliers. Use pliers on door. That door is locked. Use pliers on door. That door is locked. Use poker on door. Nope. That's right. It's a, the poker. We he will not equip the poker. He'll just say whether or not he it, it'll be useful. It's really all of the puzzle items we have. Door is locked. Do, do you want gold? I don't have I don't have room. I need to back up and make room. Do you want gold door? This door does not want gold either. Oddly, oddly, the doors are un unimpressed with my treasure of gold. Can I cut the door open? I mean, obviously the answer is going to be no. that shooting the door did not work. No cartridges left. Hmm. Fight the door. Push the door? Doesn't seem like pushing the doors will work. All right, so after you going through everything that I have to well, every I mean 
there are things like code of mail, which I, I doubt using that as like a, a puzzle thing or a story thing. Um, but using the remaining things I have for, for puzzle stuff is not working. I can only assume that maybe I need to get that bottle that's ble being blocked by the barrel, which means I would have to go back to prior before I move the barrel, which would be a, a little while back. Um, I was actually, when I did that, I wasn't able to get the bottle either. I tried to do it. I wasn't able to get it. Uh, so, but I mean, maybe that's worth a try. Um, which would be what? Not actually sure. Now this is after I killed everyone. This is, I probably moved the barrel already. No, okay, that door's closed. I didn't I didn't move it yet. I do have to kill this guy. It's kind of hard to tell what he's doing. Like is I think that his I think that his peg leg is a gun. Is that what's going on there? And he goes down. I'm unable to get. I'm, able, I'm not able to get that that bottle. I can say push, which pushes it back a little bit. I want to push it to the left. I know I can get the the mail. I, I, I can get a little bit closer to get that. I don't know about the bottle. The bottle just stands out, though. I don't know if pushing like that in increases my reach. In most other games, I would say this clearly is not what you're supposed to do. Like, I've tried this a lot, and it clear clearly doesn't work. In this game? I can't rule out the possibility. What if you run into it?
Like after the after the bit with the cannon, where I had to. It turns out that pushing was what I needed to do. I just needed to do it in a very specific position. It may very well be that I need to do that here as well, from a very specific position. Maybe I can get, like, push it back with my feet. Probably not. weird that it's pushable to begin with. Can I walk backwards into it? Probably not. Why is it pushable to begin with? I don't suppose I can use like the poker. No, it'll come. It'll come in useful elsewhere. What about if I were to use the pliers? Doesn't seem so. Let me fight the barrel. I know if I go to the left of the barrel and push it to the right, it will move a little bit. But going to the right of it and pushing it to the left does not. I don't suppose there's any way to get the enemy in this room to do it. Like, I, I don't see how. I don't see how you would- I don't see how that would work. Like, when you go into the room and you're fighting that guy, is there anything you can do to make him push it out of the way? Like, you wouldn't think so. Like, how would that even work? Doesn't seem like anything's happening. All right. Two locked doors. We don't know what those door. We don't know how to get into those doors. We don't have any keys for the doors. What we do have is a bag of gold. We have a poker. We have pliers. We have those two locked doors. We have the parrot who maybe... Maybe the parrot might do something?
this guy respawns, which is kind of odd because it doesn't seem like anyone else is. I mean, I can just kill him, but why does he come? Why does he come back? In the case of the of the cannon, it ended up being I had to like push it from right here, that exact spot. And I think at that no, he still has the cake of powder. He still had it there. I have other things to do first. Did I use the the keg of powder? Oh, was it that I had to put it down? Yeah, put it down here. Was that what that was? All right, so that's that is what the circle was for. When we got that. <sighs> now I noticed this has an option for use, which it didn't before. Like it says I can use the gold, but before it was only, it was saying I could only drop the gold. It didn't say anything about using the gold. And I, I thought I used it once. Where Carnby took out the bag of gold. It was like in the room with the oven. He took out the bag of gold and shook it. And I wasn't sure what that was, but I, it didn't let me use it again. It just said drop put. Probably should save it. So for some reason, it only let me use it once and then not again. I don't understand that. But the f the form that using it took was to like hold it up and shake it. Does that, do people need to hear the gold? Oh. Hi. Yeah, I, I remember your... I remember your article saying that you like gold. You were behind the door, huh? You needed to hear the sound that there was gold out here for you to come out? Okay. All right. This is the kitchen. I guess the idea is that maybe you would remember that this was the kitchen from when you were playing as Grace. And maybe you might realize that the cookies were in here. And you might remember the article from the book that said the cookies love gold. And now you have gold. And maybe you use the coin, you use your one use of the coins to shake it, but only once because you can't use it anymore. You can't use it anymore when... After you do it once. For reasons. This is the dumbwaiter here. I mean, Carnby is too big for the dumbwaiter. But Grace was not able to open this door. Oh, it's the big chef. 
He's got his blowgun. Metallic Jack of Diamonds. We're in the larder. Got meats hanging from the walls. Do they really have to store food in the galleon? Like, they have the mansion up above. Do they really have to keep using the ship for this? Is there anything else in there? I didn't see anything else in here. Alright, I have this. Have we seen any place where this would go? I still have the gold coins. Yeah, use is gone, look. It says drop put. The use option is not there anymore. Is there anything else in here? I think that's going to be enough for tonight's session of Alone in the Dark 2 as the game com continues to completely shit itself as we s about are about to make it to the end. Um, just complete incontinence uh, all over itself. Just of a, of, a, of a type never before seen. Um... Yeah, this game is not is not going well. Um, all right, what, what for next time? What do we have? This is what we got: the metallic jack of diamonds. I don't remember seeing anything that looked like a place where we might put this. Um, but I mean, it doesn't matter because we're just going to end up using it on something completely unrelated in an unclear way and then it'll open a door is uh i'm sh it's probably what's gonna happen there uh yeah there's also the possibility of whether or not we actually need to get that bottle that's a problem i don't know if we need the bottle i wasn't able to get the bottle it, it looked like an item it looked like it stood out on the floor I don't know if I need it. And if I need it, then I have to get it. Like, none of this other- none, none, nothing else we've done tonight really matters, because I still need to get the bottle. Um... Actually, this says use for Jack. What happens if we use it? It will come in useful elsewhere. Okay. So it's not something that he's just gonna use willy-nilly, it's just we have to be in the proper place in the proper room, standing at the proper location, looking in the proper direction, at what might end up not looking like anything, and then we use it, is, I guess, how that's going to happen. But there aren't many rooms to actually try this out in, are there? I mean, there is this room. It's still locked. Do we use it here? We sure do. Let's say goodnight with the witch. Ah, get out of my head, Charles! Very dramatic. Oh, it just- oh no, oh no! No, <laughs> we're going right back into grace! Oh no! <laughs> I thought we were done with Grace. I thought we were done with her. We're not done with her. 
I'm glad the music changed to let us know it's grace time again. <sighs> so I guess we'll continue on next time. We found where we needed to use the jack, which was just on this featureless door with no description. Like, what? Well, I don't know, was there an imprint on the door that the jack would go in? Who's to say? We won't, we don't know. It's just a locked door. I might as well rub my items on it, I guess. Why not just make it a regular key? If they weren't going to bother putting any description or some sort of detailed image on the locked door... To illustrate what it is, why not just have us get a regular key for that? And it doesn't matter. None of it don't matter. None of this matters. As we continue on with Alone in the Dark 2, probably finishing. We're probably gonna get there next time because there's not much. There doesn't seem like there could be many rooms left. It doesn't seem like it. Until next time.